Hi everybody, this is Dale. Welcome to my channel, Not Too Shabby Chic. Today I have an unboxing for you that is from BB Craft. You all are probably very familiar with BB Craft. They have amazing products and they have also a program that if you have more than 100 subscribers, you can join in the program and get products and try them, do a video uh, unboxing and then two tutorials using those products um, with BB Craft. So it will be in the link below their website where you could check that out. I'll also be linking below the um, item numbers and links for the items that I got from BB Crafts today. Sorry, I had a tickle. And I'm really excited. Um, you recall the last ones that I did. I had some stencils, some rickrack, some die cuts, and just some wonderful products. This time, I've got some more exciting products. And you know, only when you're doing a video do people start calling you, right? So thank you, BB Craft, for allowing me to use your products and share them on my YouTube channel. It's really exciting. I already opened the bags and what have you so that it wouldn't be quite so crinkly when I was showing them to you. So let me show you what I've got. First, I have this product number. And this is for a little box of um, charms. I'm going to be doing a sewing journal and a cookbook journal, which um, my last video I told you about the cookbook journal because I was using the Rick Rack and some of those stencils that were amazing uh, to make some things for my cookbook journal. After that, I'm going to be making a sewing journal. So these charms will be perfect and I love the way they're packaged and this nice heavy plastic little container we have uh, antique gold and gold so we have these really cute little fancy hanger uh, clothes hanger charms let's see if I can get this to focus there we go isn't that cute and it's got the little thing on the top there so you can hang it from a page from a tag from a tassel just cute and as you can see you get quite a few of each one about 10 or so then we have a bag of little sewing machines cute love these little charms they are just adorable and we have also these sewing machines which are like 3d well might help if I turned it the right way isn't that cute love it and they'll sit up you know um, but to use them in a journal, you could put these in a dollhouse, actually. These would also be really cute in a little dollhouse. But they have the little hook there for you to put chain or, or thread through it. And then we have, and I have some of each. So I got the antique gold, and then you got some that I'll be showing you next in the bright gold. So, and I love that too. Here's a... Uh, a little knitting needles and yarn cute just love all these charms so this is going to be fun and more knitting needles in the bright gold that goes there then in the bright gold only we have the scissors super cute cute they look like you could squeeze them and use them dee -dee 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 -dee. again you could use this stuff for doll doll houses too but they're going to be great for my sewing journals and then I have these little hammers 
um, which maybe aren't necessarily for a sewing theme, but I might would bang on my sewing machine with something occasionally. Get something stuck. Isn't that cute? I just love it. So this will be adorable in any kind of journal, actually. Then there are some gold, bright gold hangers like the antique gold ones. And then the sewing machines that are just like the antique gold ones that I showed you already. You have those. So that is a lot of charms. And I'm so excited to use these and show you how I'm going to use them. Because there are, again, so many ways you can use charms in your journals. So um, I'll finish putting those up shortly. Thank you, BB Craft. Love those charms. And I don't want to lose my packing slip because um, that is how I have my they get they send you a packing slip which has all the items as well and then you have your wrapping that shows you your item number this item number is for some uh, cling stamps you get one sheet of the stamps and I will link all these below and look at this these are wonderful clean stamps that will be great on my tags when I'm making them with these. Um, I'm pointing at them and you can't see them. Sewing charms. But look at these beautiful, it says sewing seams. Taylor, or I think that's supposed to be a T, but it looks like an L. You've got the address form thread, the coat hanger, a button, scissors, a zipper, measuring tape, a pin cushion, just beautiful lacy trim, yarn, fabric, bigger scissors, a little safety pin, the sewing machine. Aren't these adorable? I uh, love these stamps and so excited to get ready to use them. Thank you, BB Craft, once again. So you can use them by yourself or put them on those blocks. And I believe BB Craft also has the little blocks you can order. So those are awesome. Then I was found these um, and was super excited. These are all kinds of little sewing tags. You can sew them into a, something you're making or I wanted to use them in a journal. So this says, on this side, handmade, let's see if we can focus, handmade, and then this side says, with heart, with love, we know that means with love. So you get, uh, I've got a bunch of those with the, um, handmade with love with the heart and then these say handmade with love but on the front they have show you one they have the scissors they're cute these will be cute for little tabs well I can't tell you I'm going to give it away so we'll see what I do with these the other one just had the little um, flower. Then we have this. It's like a little wreath, and it says handmade. And on the back, with love. And they also open up. So, you know, you can do different things with them. So that's like a little wreath. Come on, camera. Isn't that cute? I just love all of these. They're so pretty. Here's one with the knitting needles and the yarn. And you get a lot of each one. Look at this one with a kitty cat. Handmade. 
and it's got the little kitty cat on it. And this one has the pin cushion, scissors, and thread. And with love on the back. Aren't they cute? I'm just excited about these. And I love this one. It says handmade and like the scissors are cutting out around the little tag. Let me show you. Handmade. So this is just handmade. So you put these on things that you didn't make with love. You just handmade them. Just kidding. You may have things you don't want to say with love. Love it. And this one says handmade with love on the front. And you get the black and the brown. And then on the back is blank. Like so. And the front. Aren't they neat? These are just, I'm so excited to find these. This one is a pair of scissors with a measuring tape around it. Isn't that cute? And it's blank on the, no, it's got with love on the back. So adorable BB craft. Look at all these. I mean, you just get tons see what this is. This one's really cute. I just love all these. I'm so excited to use these. These are like some of my favorite things that I've ordered so far. This is handmade with love on this side. And then this side says handmade. And it's a ball of yarn. And you can barely see it, but it's a kitty cat peeking up over the ball of yarn. Because we all know kitty cats like to play with yarn. This one is one with a sewing machine. And the other thing I like is if you're like me and you like the edges to be frayed, you can do that. Or you can just snip the, the fabric so that it won't fray. But I like them frayed. So there is the cool sewing machine. Then on the back, Handmade with Love. They adorable, and they almost have a tea dyed look, um, but so you don't really have to do anything to them. Although I may coffee dye some and leave some plain. So here's one with scissors and a needle and thread. Cute and handmade with love, or you know, with love on the back. And my goodness, I've got, I didn't realize, yeah, you just get so many. Look at all these. And I love these little tabs. I will be using these up and getting more. And here's the little sheep with love. Ba ba black sheep. Have you any wool? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Three bags full. One for the master and one for the dame. I had to do that for BB. BB's closet, not BB craft. <laughs> this is handmade and it's um, got a needle and thread crisscrossed with different symbols like a thimble, a spool, and with love. Super cute, too. And this is a great idea, gives me a great idea to make my own, too. But these are, I mean, this was very tedious and to make this many so this is a great value from BB craft um, this is a really cool sewing machine this is handmade and of course with love and we still have more guys <laughs> This is just a pretty handmade and with love on the back. 
so many uses for these are just rolling through my brain and I'm sure yours too so you will definitely want to get you some look at the safety pins handmade with love and the back is blank so on the back of the ones that are blank or even the ones with the hearts handmade another one with the sewing machine and the back says with love with the heart you could put your initials um, or stamp that on there for yourself this says knitting and sewing isn't that cute Hang on. there we go and then on the back 100% cotton isn't that cute love it these are adorable and this one is a butterfly BB and MJ handmade nice little butterfly and of course with love on the back so these are all that you get in one pack I mean look at all this it's amazing you get a lot of each one so those are absolutely amazing thank you BB craft for these they're fabulous I think I just squished the wrong thing sorry guys now last but not least I have this giant box of bulb pins look at all the colors look 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 are these not to die for absolutely beautiful I'm so excited here is the item number for the bulb pins the multicolored box And I will link the product below with the product number. And I've got to find the one <laughs> for the um, labels. I don't think I showed you that one. So when I discover that, I will be posting that as well. And that goes there. So let's look at the bulb pins. You get a lot of each color. Beautiful mustardy yellow, I get. No, well, maybe not mustard. Pretty yellow. You've got the copper. Every color in the rainbow. Pretty red, white blue I can't wait to use these and show you some things you may not have thought about to use bulb pins for and because you've got the gold then you've got pink brown lavender this bright metallic green and the antique gold and then you've got like olive green gunmetal gray metallic purple the bright blue beige I love these beige ones and these taupe brown colored ones are gorgeous then you've got um, a, a spring green I call it and then this is a pretty mulberry color aren't those gorgeous and you get so many and then this real pretty burnt orange color and a fuchsia or bright pink and you've got your silver and black so um, you look at all these you get 24 colors and they come in this wonderful box to keep them in so I will be linking all this below um, for you guys to check out 
and within the next two to three weeks I will be doing some tutorials showing you how to use these products so thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video bye bye